Hi there folks, I thought I'd use the nice weather, that sure thing turned a little bit darker and a little bit, at least it looks a little bit wetter than before, but it's still relatively warm and uh, my plans for the weekend were, yeah let's say uh, I had other plans that didn't quite win this plant so I went back to Castle and uh, I'm looking forward to get my head a little bit uh, cleared out by riding so I'm planning on going to some old castle but it's really freaking nice here around So there is, uh, right here, is a place where the wall between West uh, Germany and East Germany went until 89. Yeah, I guess you have a good lookout from, from this hill. There are a lot of castles around here. I think the one I'm going to, or plan going to, is Maybe this one? I don't know if you can see it already. I think it's called Burg Hahnstein or something like this, so Castle Hahnstein. Where should I park without the bike being wrecked? Maybe here. So in gear and it's not rolling away. So oh, that's that. Oh, there is a...
So now for the guys that don't know what actually happened in a, in a castle in Europe, they were more or less like uh, the castle there and then some walls and trenches and the knights camped in front of the, the castle. So na very nice uh, puppy puppet whatever. <laughs> Hi doggy. A lot of dogs. And a lot of people actually. But uh, after climbing the tower and uh, waiting in the sun for the wind to go down a little bit so I can start the drone, I'm quite exhausted and <laughs> sweating my balls off. But it's, it's really nice, even without the sun. The, the yellow tone of the landscape, some nice horses. And I'm just rolling down. It's quite interesting, the castle itself uh, was documented for the first time in 826, I think, if I remember right. Um, so long 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 before some other states were in place and uh, was destroyed thousand and a few years um, or in thousand and few years by emperor some whatever and then it was destroyed in 1300 something and then in Eastern Germany they used it as some kind of holiday uh, home for children to get them in line with the party. So quite a eventful history there. And also some, some nice looks over the landscape. Oh man, that street is bad really really bad so now I'm on the we made it and have a straight uh, road in front of us and a lot of wind so I have time it's Sunday I don't have to race I'm just enjoying myself I also have my uh, Ogeo Nodrag Mark V with me, still testing out all the accessories and possibilities the backpack has and uh, the, the pouch for, uh, I think it's um, Ogeo Reservoir Hydration something something, the, the drinking thing. Um, I bought myself a Camelback and it fits yeah, quite well. So I got like 70 ounces, so 2 liters. And it's very comfortable to, to drink. I don't know if you can see this there. And it fits into the helmet and you can drink while cruising or when you wait at a red light. Vin -vin. That was uh, a bit scary. Oh, and up there, there is another castle. I don't know if you can see it there through the, the trees. That's cool. So maybe I, I go here more often. Oh, there. Nice. I think that's another castle.
you doing, mister? Okay, thank you. Looks kind of sweet. It smells delicious. <laughs> sure, sure. When, when I come, there is a train. I guess it's the only train going through on a Sunday. Uh, it goes through at 2.20. Sure, that sounds like a reasonable time. It's very windy here. But I'm rolling back into Kassel in a few minutes. She's a thirsty girl, I have to use the next gas station. And so I would say... Uh, bye! It was a pleasure having you, like always. Don't kill me for my... my English while riding. I think it's improving, at least in baby steps. So greetings to uh, you all, especially the long way up to California, and I guess I'll see you around. Bye!